We welcome you from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Dame time, joining forces with the Greek Freak. Ready to get it started. Dynamic duo now in Milwaukee. And this could be a lethal pick and roll combination. We're gonna work on this new season, man. Think about all the work we put in over the last couple of weeks, man. The, the grinding, the, the getting to it, whatever it is, man. Make count this year. Let's get together through it all. Let's get it, man. Bucks on three. One, two, three. Bucks. points as a Milwaukee Buck for call and it goes and Lillard is starting to find himself he never has the half hand we're gonna find him got a sense he wasn't gonna let us lose he knew when he had to take over Dame Lillard may be the best closer in the game I know what I'm here to do and I know how to do it What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? We showed up to the Y first time I ever been a part of wheelchair basketball. Man, it was fire. It was cool. I applaud those kids. I applaud everyone that plays because this is a different game. All the rolling, and then you got to shoot. And everything with the arm, that's tough. I'm, I'm geeked up. Hopefully, I'm not too geeked. Good catch. Whoop, 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 whoop. Taylor, Julian, Taylor, Julian. Bro, kid you not, never seen this, ever. Crazy. Bruh, handle. I love it, she's making it work. Hold on to the ball with her chin. I love it. AJ was with us, he got in the wheelchair, I ain't getting in the wheelchair. Yeah, I'll do it. It's like this. Oh, I'm going out of control. Don't let the hat get in the way. We're good. There we go. Got one to fall. It's all arms. It's a lot different. Yeah, let's do it. This is the best section right here. We got to have so much fun. I get some work. I get some work. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> good pass. Hey, good pass. Are you left handed? Switch. Switch. Oh, yeah. Getting it here. Getting that working. Touch pass. Behind the back pass. Basketball is universal. That's that's why I love it so much. And they even make me just sit back and look like, man, don't take nothing for granted. It's cool just to at least even have those events for us to come. Uh, I had a great time. It was fun. Can't wait to do the next one. We've played wheelchair basketball before in college. There was like pros though, like we played against them. And I show up thinking it's just gonna be, we'll shoot some shots, wheel around. And they're coming up like setting screens on us, pushing in transition, like killing us. So it's actually super hard, but it's fun, it's super fun. A lot of excitement in the building. Uh, it was fun to see everyone in the gym. I thought it was a good day. It was just fun to get that first day going. You know, a lot, a lot has been said, has been talked about, but being able to get to the, the actual work and the, the part that we, you know, show up to do is is always fun. I love it so far. I'm not even gonna lie. I feel like our physicality is on a, another level. Guys are extremely competitive. Every game we play, it's a competitive game. Everything is competitive. One of our pillars is a competitive spirit, and you have to find ways and practice to nurture, nurture that competitiveness every day. We're all playing with force. We're all trying to do the right thing. We're all trying to buy in the coach. Coach Griff allows us 
to be us. Not as easy flood. Out the bucket, Smart Jones with 15 points. Chris Middleton knocks down his second. Giannis shovels the handoff. Damian Lillard didn't even that one was good. The second he let it go from about six steps behind the arc. It's about them just building some chemistry, getting to know each other. It is a new team. They got to learn and grow, find out each other's strength and, and non-strength. I don't want him to not be himself. You know, I want him to be who he is and don't worry about me. Don't worry about not allowing me to do what I got to do because I know how to play this game. I know how to be myself, you know, in any environment. Dame is here to be Dame and we're going to let Dame be Dame in no shape or form any competition with between me and him who's going to have the ball more. He will have the ball more. It makes it more comfortable as well when you got the guy saying, just do you. You just tell me what you need me to do and I'll do it. I got to set 50 screens for Dame to get an open shot. He knows and I know and I think the team knows that I'm going to set those 50 screens because at the end of the day, I want to win and uh, I hope we can put ourselves in position to win a third championship for the city of Milwaukee with the talent and uh, the people that we have on this team. It's almost been like in segments, meaning we had a camp and then played two games pretty quickly. Then we kind of had a big break in between, so almost another camp. Hi, Mom. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> she ate your bees. If that were a two-man special, yeah. then we can cut and Whatever. slot you. Exactly. That's great basketball. Because it's what we said. It's not, it's not about the play we're running. It's the play you guys make. Right. I don't think you were there. Yeah. So you, you want to take a charge. Well, I think the nice thing was that we had a couple of games under our belt when we had done it. You follow that up with the time to start, sort of digest what took place in those two games, plus continue to build on your system. So it, it was uh, very productive in that regard. You let him come get you. Go get him. Good. Go get him. No matter what, close out with the stick hand. I know that was more jab, 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 but the initial close out. If you want to do a two-man special on that weak side and flare it, you can. Eagles, eagles, eagles. Yeah, I was here, it was five years ago. Great years. You trying to get out, we've had great possessions. Have to continue to do that, all right? This is what we saw the other day. We just need to clean that up. Any questions? Any questions? Good. Informative years for a couple of the guys, uh, Chris and Giannis. You know, just watching them develop during that time and watching them continue to grow. But one of the things that I saw was a lot of veteran players come into the program. There's a very good balance here. And so for me to see that evolution and to be back and be a part of it is, is very special. Yeah, I mean, that's a big day for just saying thank you to the fans. Like, we want you guys sitting out there watching to know that we care and we want to make sure that you get to the first look at what this is going to be like. So it's always a cool part for us to, like, put a couple last-minute things together, but also make sure that the fans know that, you know, you're a part of this, too. Man, it was fun, it was fun. They were excited to see us. It was cool to be around the fans. Actually, honestly, like to get that feel, like how they cheer. I know it sounds crazy, but like, it's cool. They was cheering on Bobby. Like, like, like those kind of, those kind of things, man, give, give players confidence to come out there and play even harder. Yeah, fans were amazing. The practice itself was very productive. Coach Griff was great with his message on, you know, wanting to be productive and get something done and our guys really responded to that. We're gonna have a lot of fun this year. Fans do a terrific job, man. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be on their back to keep it, keep it up. Uh, you're gonna hear me all the time. Just fans, fans, fans. I'm, I'm big on that. So uh, I love having fun out there on the court. Everybody know I'm like big on dancing and stuff. So man, it's gonna be a fun season. They're gonna be really excited. I know they're gonna have our back through the whole season. So looking forward to it. Even though it said Team Prenti and Team Mutombo, we had multiple people coaching the games. We had 
different scenarios within the games, like we adjusted the score one time so we could get some work in, and that's one of the beauties of what we're doing and what Coach is doing, is putting us in situations that we're going to see moving forward so that we can react accordingly when that particular thing happens. All the work is in practice, which is great, but we want to roll the ball out there and go get some wins and make our way towards that championship. We welcome you from Milwaukee, Wisconsin on a Thursday night. Big name, new place, Damian Lillard. After 11 years in Portland, Dame time, joining forces with the Greek Freak. Ready to get it started. Mm -hmm. They are so excited to get this season started and a dynamic duo now in Milwaukee. Yeah, look, they were the only team in the league. It's got two guys who averaged 30 last year. Dame Lillard may be the best closer in the game, and this could be a lethal pick and roll combination. I mean, it's been over a decade since he's been wanting to have the opportunity to contend for a championship. So this is a situation where he is relishing. He looked at that roster, looked at the coaching staff, and he said, this is where I'm supposed to be. So he feels that strongly about their chances to really do something special. How are you feeling? Where's your mind at? Coming into I mean, I feel good. I'm not out there playing. <laughs> this league is about the players. I always will be. It's an honor and privilege, obviously, to be the head coach of this team. So I'm, I'm extremely grateful. But at the same time, we have a job to do. The focus should be on our performance and, and getting our team ready. And I feel like we're well prepared. And ask me that question after the game. Uh -oh. So y'all, yeah, man, as we embark on this new season, man, think about all the work we put in over the last couple of weeks, man, the, the grinding, the, the line drills, the competing, the getting to it, whatever it is, man, make this count this year. 1 to 82, it's going to be a long journey, that verse is going to hit tonight, tomorrow, whatever it is, but stick together through it all, let's hit it, man, bucks on three, one, two, three, bucks! From Weaver St. Yeah, let's get into it. We got basketball to play here as they'll put it in the air and the Bucks control the tip and game time is officially underway in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Yeah, it was definitely different. The thing that I appreciated the most was just the fact that I didn't have to be so responsible for everything. This is going to help me be stronger for a complete game. Damian Lillard, there you go. His first points as a Milwaukee Buck. Looking for a call, and he gets it, and it goes. Damian Lillard a chance at a four-point play. Here's Lillard the other way. Dane takes it all the way inside, wiggles his way through the defense, has an easy layup, and Lillard is starting to find himself. Dame is Dane. He's a rhythm player. I mean, he had it going. Puts up a tough shot, and Dane Lillard is cooking now. It was fun, honestly. I was just like, I know who I am. I know what I'm here to do, and I know how to do it. He just got a sense during the game he wasn't going to let us lose. He knew when he had to take over. First game of the season, and yeah, we got a good one here. Drives around Uber, gets the corner, lays it off the window and good! What a foul! Damian Lillard! Towards the end of the game, Jay, Cam, you know, they in my ear like, Dane, finish him, close it out. I think we was up two. I knew I wasn't going to have space to attack, so I kind of just baited him and held it. But once I stayed up and I saw that it was just me and him one-on-one, -on -one, I was like, I'm going to try to get to a spot. So I kind of hit the gas to get him on his heels, and then I changed direction. And he tried to cut that move off, and then I changed direction again. 
and went into my step back, I had enough space to get a, a clean look. So um, that's a look that I take seven days a week. You know, it was a comfort shot. Damian Lillard, three-pointer flies. And he's got another one. Damian Lillard doing what he does. If I can get that type of opportunity, I'm going to take it every time. Damian Lillard, what a debut in Milwaukee. 39 points. He scored 14 of those 39 in the last four minutes. Your debut with the Bucks. How did you feel? Uh, I mean, honestly, I felt a little tired. You know, it was a long summer for me. I didn't get to do my normal buildup, but, uh, you know, I, I know as good as anybody that down the stretch is a mental game. When you got that type of uh, encouragement from your team, especially a new team, all it does is make you you're more comfortable to, to be who you are. First win, first win of the season. Got that day in time, too. One out of 82. It's a hell of a start to the season. You know, now we got to just keep stacking them up, keep adding them up. You know, he's a big time player. I mean, big time players, they do special things out there. I'm trying to win. Obviously, like, he has the hat hand, and you just got to keep on feeding him. You got to keep on going to what works. He has to know that whenever he has the hat hand down the stretch, we're going to find him. They're encouraging me to be the person to take control and make decisions and, you know, decide what's going to happen in those moments. And that's what I'm here to do. I'm very excited. The team is very excited to go through the season with him. Yeah. Not much to say. You guys left that out there, right? We're down four. You guys show what we're made of, the resolve, the toughness. You buckle down, you got to win. That is, you know, you guys were awesome. There's one announcement here, all right? Most field goals in franchise history. No. Ever. Giannis.